Hello everyone, this is Edmund from imlicious.com and today I'm going to review a Philorama Premium along with a Philo Tools which is a tracking tool that comes together with the Philorama Premium membership and uh, a Philorama Premium is actually priced at $67 per month if you can actually get it for free for the first month when you sign up for a Philo Blueprint and subsequently you'll be billed $67 every month thereafter and uh, it is basically a subscription that you can cancel at any time so there's no prior commitments to it and of course it comes with a 60 days money back guarantee as well if you in the event you don't like it you can always return it for a full refund okay so this is basically how the premium membership looks like first of all you get the current premium magazine okay which you can actually download the issue you can download it in terms of the interview you can also get PR articles uh, along with behind the scenes as well so all these are downloadable, downloadable stuff okay and this is the affiliate tools as well which I'll be showing you later on and um, you also get some other materials that comes with Affiliorama Premium that is the Premium Vault topics on how to create a digital product creation how to create a digital product you can actually click here to view all the Premium Vault videos inside here they even have on article spinning, how to find profitable CPN niches, along with quality articles outsourcing tips, affiliate video formula, along with other useful information as well on Facebook traffic secrets. There's really a wealth of information that you cannot find in the normal membership, the free membership, which you can only get via the premium membership. Okay, so you can actually get hosting as well. You can uh, get a premium hosting okay so that's basically part of the things that come with a Fluorama premium okay so that's basically how it's like when you get the premium membership okay so I'm gonna show you the Aflo tools so this is basically a Aflo tool so before you get started with this tool, all you got to do is just um, include, enter your URL, your website. In this case, I'm just going to add imlicious.com and I'm going just going to name my project name as imlicious. And after you're done with this, just click add. Okay. So after you have added, you can actually go to the dashboard. Okay. So here you can actually check out the performance of your website and you can actually track how many keyword positions has changed over the past 24 hours and which keywords are in the top 5 position along with which keywords are in the top 10 position and besides that it also measures your, the speed of your website it will inform you about any site warnings or SEO warnings that you may have so it's really very useful and besides that you can manage keywords as well so here you can um, import the keywords for your Google Analytics account or you can even key in the keywords that you want so in this case let's say I'm key internet marketing for my site so I just click add all so after you key in the keyword itself they actually tick here so this is basically a checklist of things that you need to do so after you've done this you just got to connect to Google Analytics account okay here you just got to key in your email address and password because Google Analytics is actually for free so you don't have to pay any extra money on it you can even connect your Facebook and Twitter after everything is done you can just click the finish your introduction thing okay so you can even go for health check under the section here so under the health check you actually check out all, the, all your websites you can add a Google feed as well okay you'll check all how each website of yours is performing in terms of the pitch authority, the pitch rank, as well as whether there are any SEO warnings. Here they will actually show you how many pages are indexed over the years, over the months. Okay, so if you have anything that you're not clear, you can just um, click the help center here, so it's very useful. Then you can go on to traffic. So do know that you have to add, connect the Google feed whereby you have to request a token that's basically under Google Analytics so it's nothing complicated there okay so what I really like about this tool itself is that they even have a section on the Clickbank revenue whereby you can connect Clickbank as well you can track 
how many sales you have made and how many refunds, how many chargebacks and how much money you have made over the years. So it's basically a very useful tool as you can track your performance of your of the products that you are promoting as well. Very convenient because you don't have to check it manually. And you can even manage the search engines as well. In this case, uh, I'm living in Singapore so they put it by random, Google Singapore and Bing Singapore. And of course you can click the one that you want to add, let's say you want to add um, Google United States, just go click here and just click add search engine. But for our case, we'll be focusing more on Google United States and we can just delete those that you don't want. We'll be focusing more on United States because that's where the bulk of the online customers will come from. Okay. Then you can also check your rankings as well. Keywords that you have ranked along with the backlink analysis as well. So here you just got to click the analyze button and you can see what you are ranking for and uh, what is the IP address as well as the anchor text that you are ranking for how many links are there in total and you can even connect to your Facebook as well to see the number of visitors where they are coming from and how many likes you've received along with Twitter as well so it's really very comprehensive it's basically a all-in-one tool and besides that, you can also research on the keywords as well. So let's say I want to research on the keyword internet marketing. And you can select it based on which country you're interested in. In this case, you put it as United States, which so is search. Okay, so under here, you can see all the local monthly volume, how many people are searching per month, and what's the average cost per click, and what's the competition light. 0 0.96 means that it's actually very competitive, and how many websites are actually indexed for the target keyword internet marketing so you can see there are 584 million sites indexed in internet marketing which is really a lot okay so i mean it's crazy so many sites which explains why the competition is so much as well <laughs> which makes sense okay so you can move on to domains as well so let's say if you want to analyze, you can look for domain names as well. Let's say you want to register a, a domain to in the internet marketing niche or let's say weight loss niche. So you can put in weight loss and you can just click find domains. So inside here, they'll actually show you like, okay, in this case, uh, weight loss is taken. .com, .net and .org is all taken by other people. So here you can just you can choose whether you want to put hyphens in between or you want to put a created a variation of each keyword okay so in fact all these are taken so it's actually very useful you can check the availability of the domain name through this tool as well and you can even click on the links checker as well okay what I really like about this affiliate tools right is the part on the link finder because right now Google is actually putting a lot of emphasis on the type of links that you are getting so this link finder will come in very very handy in this case you can look for sites that provide guest posting or you can even look for sites that you can uh, publish your comments on you can even look for directories reviews and sponsored links along with direct other form of directories as well as resources as well so let's say if you're interested to look for sites that provide guest posting for your target niche let's say weight loss so all you got to do is um, just key in weight loss sorry about that but all you got to do just key in weight loss and just click find links okay so after you click the find links they'll inform you they'll t inform you about all the sites that provide guest posting for the weight loss niche as you can see here guest post guest post so these are basically sites that that you can consider for guest posting in a related niche and what I really like about this tool is that it actually informs you the domain authority along with the page authority as well so if you want to get the best results for your link building right I will suggest publishing your posts on sites with the highest domain authority you can see here the domain authority 100.98.96. So all these are all very very reputable websites. I encourage you to select a few blogs or a few do websites that provide guest posting in this range, probably 80 plus to 100. 
under the domain authority side of things so that the link will be very quality even if it get published on the site itself so this is basically one area that you want to explore because um, guest posting is an actu is actually very good for you to get some white hat backlinks along with a lot of um, user engagement as well very uh, excellent way to promote your website okay so you can actually run new search after you're done and you can do the same for the other types of links as well uh, like for blog commenting and uh, directories and so on so that's basically it on the research side of things and if you want to change the website settings you can just click here so here you can add in your Facebook, your Twitter, Clickbank, uh, site information, Google AdWords and so on so that basically sums up the walkthrough for Affiliate Tools I hope that I've given you enough information on this tool it's itself and its usefulness if you're really serious about succeeding online um, investing in quality tools like the Affiliate Tools will definitely be a great way for you to monitor your progress because what gets tracked will get improved so if you track your results on a daily basis, on a monthly basis, you can actually find out what corrections you need to do in order to improve your site and ultimately to generate more revenue, revenue as well. So with that, this is Edmund signing off. Thank you for listening and goodbye. See ya!